trying to keep us down? Like some sort of villain? No way! Hawkman's an awesome hero whose daddy was a hawk and whose mama was a man. Oh yeah? I heard he was an ancient Egyptian prince back from the dead. He is the Thanagarian. Gesundheit? Hawkman's just like this vegan cheesesteak. Hawk, mm, mm. He shouldn't even exist, but he does, and he's perfect. Ah. Wow, would have been cool to have a perfect friend. Well, we probably won't be friends with Hawkman after today, but I can hook you up with this cheesesteak. Really? Oh, yeah, do it, do it, do it. Hey, y'all, I'm alive now, in case you was wondering. Happy birthday, vegan cheesesteak! Gosh, I'm so excited, I'm leaking cheese out of my mouth. Raven, isn't your magic evil? Yeah, but the sandwiches here are so good, it's all gonna even out. Come on, little sandwich, let's jet. Well, I'd like to, but I ain't got none of them legally bits. That's all right, man, I got you. Nanobots! <laughs> I'm living the dream. <laughs> hey, isn't that Robin and Hawkman? Robin! Mother, stop the stroller! <laughs> Robin, what is the going on? Why do you keep saying Robin? Ow, 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 ow. Is one of you being robbed? No, Robin. Oh, no, no one's robbing anyone. <laughs> well, you're Robin. Oh, so you would dare to accuse an officer of the peace and an heir to the throne of Thanagar of petty theft? Robin, what is the wrong with you? If one more of you says Robin, I'll tell my mommy to come over here and beat you up. He's got you mind controlled, man! You gotta fight him! Hawkman is a villain. But Grandma, Robin wasn't being mind controlled. He just had a bop on the noodle. Oh, I know. But the great disaster had already begun. And after what happened next, Robin could never consider us part of a superhero team again. Robin, no! I'm again, nigga! <laughs> oh, vegan cheesesteak, you truly are a superfood! You can't die! It's all right, Papa. Y'all showed me that. Cybernetic or vegan, white or wheat. We all are one. No, I mean, literally, you can't die because of the nanobots. Golly gosh, that's real neat! You're the perfect sandwich! And you can self-replicate! Kennedy! It's non-meat party time, yo! I cannot. I am in a committed non-meat relationship. Non-meat will upset my belly. I really just want to know what time it is. Aww, and I know Raven doesn't want any. I want non-meat. Ah, you, you do? do? I do? If you say so, Mama. Mmm, keep that non meat coming. Participating in one of Beast Boy's inane activities? Why are you being so nice, Raven? I don't know. Whatever the reason, it means the world to me, Mama. Tofu in your face! Uh oh, I know that look, Beastie. Run! <laughs> Well, don't leave me hanging. Yeah! Uh, uh. <laughs> Beast Boy, you're so crazy! Ah, what is happening to me?! <laughs> oh, hope I'm not interrupting. I just wanted to congratulate the Chili on his upcoming nuptials. <laughs> Then I shall give you a moment to do the bro out. Well, you won her heart fair and square, my good man. So you think you can steal Starfire from me just by being delicious? Do you, huh, huh? You think you're so hot? Well, let's see how hot you can get. <laughs> Looks like you're starting to sweat. What'd you say? Come on, bro, say it again. Say it to my face. Chili! <laughs> it burns! Something strange is happening to me. When did I start being so nice? 
Friend Raven, do you have a moment? Uh, of course I do. <clears throat> I realize you have the doubts about my engagement, but the Chili and I hope you will join us for the wedding. Of course I won't. Miss your wedding, star. Really? I was having the second thoughts, but if you are so supportive, it must be the right thing to do. As long as you're happy, I'm happy. Wonderful! Oh, the Chili will be so happy to hear we have your blessings. Chili! Ah! <laughs> so you get my little pun now? Remember? Have a nice day? I cursed you so you can only be nice. Why? To force you to make a decision. Be nice or be mean. No more of this mean stuff. It's not a word. <sighs> Thank you for taking an interest in me, but I'll have to get back to you. Very well. Before I go, can I get a hug? Uh, oh! We should eat breakfast for dinner! What? My mind is doing the blowing! That is the best idea ever! No! You can't have breakfast for dinner! It's unnatural, like wearing socks with sandals! <laughs> But breakfast is the most important meal of the day. Yes, but what's even more important is eating well-balanced meals. And terrible things could happen if you throw off that balance. Relax, dude. Nothing bad is going to happen. It's just breakfast. <laughs> now who wants some eggs? I'll take them. Stop! You don't know what you're doing! Ah! Yes, I do. I'm frying up some eggs. And I'm squeezing some of that good orange juice. Ah, it burns! It burns! And I am making the cake so Titans, I'm warning you! Your careless eating habits are going to upset the balance! Would you relax, dude? Now why don't you sit your whiny little butt down and enjoy some breakfast food with us? No way! There is nothing that's going to make me eat breakfast for dinner! Not even a bowl of creamed wheat? Mmm, I do love creamed wheat. So soggy and flavorless. Uh, how can I resist? Uh. See, dude, nothing bad happened. I guess eating breakfast for dinner is okay, as long as we make sure to never do it again. Hey, Titans, what's for lunch? I thought we were never doing this again. That was breakfast for dinner. And this is breakfast for lunch. It is the entirely different. Plus, we made your favorite. Creamed wheat? Well, I suppose one more meal couldn't hurt. <laughs> wow, that was the best lunch I've ever had! It certainly was the most delicious. Breakfast foods are the best. Yo, I bet every meal is better as breakfast. You better hatch my potato, fry my steak with eggs, make my toast scratch cookies like I always said. I want breakfast. Oh, I want breakfast. Lunch has been surpassed, dinner's been outclassed. All I want is breakfast. Whether seven in the morning or ten o'clock at night, well, bacon satisfies when you jump to four by the old breakfast. Ooh, come on, come on, breakfast. Before my first and last, you know I gotta get that breakfast. Breakfast, baby. All I Recast and make it how I ask. Say, hurry up, baby. All I want is breakfast. <sighs> Once upon those olden times, Hansel and Gretel ate all the food and got kicked out of the house. <laughs> I told you not to eat all the snitchels. Maybe you should have shared the strudel. Well, great. Now we're starving and lost in the forest. That's not even the worst of it, bro. I hear there's witches out here. <gasps> oh, you! Stop! Little children, all alone in the forest? You must be starving. Why not have a nibble of mine scrumptious candy house to fill those tummies? Don't you live in there? Well, yeah. This is mine house. So you walk around in there getting your hair stuck in everything? Perhaps there's a bit of armpit hairs here and there, yeah. Who cares if there's armpit hair? Look at those gumdrops! <sighs> All right, leave your house. These foolish children 
have no idea I lured them here to be eaten. Ugh, I am so hungry, but they will make quite a meal. <laughs> yoo -hoo, little children. You cannot start the meal with dessert. Why not try a hot appetizer instead? Dipping sauce in the fountain. Ah! Woo! <laughs> hey, they were going to eat my house, you old bag. I think they should decide. Yoo-hoo! <laughs> Do not fill up on appetizers, my Liebchen. The main course is ready. Try my delicious meat and potato house. I love me! I love potatoes! <laughs> You leeches are eating all of the children I lure here. I'm starving. Don't blame us if the children refuse to eat your hairy candy canes. <gasps> How dare you speak of mine candy canes in such ways? That was so yummy. Uh, thanks for the meal, ladies. Catch you later. Our delicious house is gone! Where will they live now? I cannot afford another appetizer house! You hold me on the fixed incomes! <laughs> <laughs> and so Hansel and Gretel left, having enjoyed a delicious three-course meal. And the witches froze to death during the long winter that followed. Moral of the story, don't make your house out of foods. <laughs> <laughs> Calm down. There's no way to know for sure who did that. <laughs> That's what you get for napping on the burger side. <laughs> We're sick and tired of both of you. This yeah. has gone on too long. Time to finally settle this. What Robin is trying to say is that we are having trouble understanding the point of your waffles game. Perhaps you can explain its appeal? <laughs> Incredibly annoying. Let's change the subject, quick. Good idea. How about I make breakfast? What do you guys feel like? Waffles. Waffles. Of course you do. <laughs> Waffles. Right. Here you go. Waffles. Waffles, waffles, waffles. Waffles, waffles? <laughs> waffles, waffles. Is that not what you asked for? Waffles? Ah, it's going to be a long day. <sighs> waffles. <laughs> waffles. 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 Waffles, waffles, waffles. Waffles. Hmm. Something up? Maybe. The computer is picking up a strange distress signal from the other side of town. I think we should check it out. Then we are with you. Let's do it. Titans, go! Waffles! Waffles, waffles! Uh, why don't you two sit this one out? Waffles? Yeah, we got this. Waffles. 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 Try some pico de gallo. It ain't spicy. Pico de gallo, eh? Mm. What's in it? Mostly tomatoes. 
I like tomatoes. Ah! It burns! It burns! You said tomatoes! Oh, there's some onions in there, too. Onions! It's fire! It's agony! Perhaps you might enjoy the unadorned chip of the tortilla? A plain chip? I can do that. I can't breathe, I can't breathe, I can't breathe. It was just a lightly salted chip, dude. Salted? <laughs> Are you trying to kill me? No more! There must be some way to get the friend Robin to eat the food item he would normally avoid. Hmm. Oh, I got it! Avocado! No, 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 more of your spicy foods. Bro, this avocado is a superfood. Avocado's got those good monounsaturated fats, son. The kind that can help lower cholesterol. See you later, triglycerides. The avocado is also the sodium-free and can reduce the risk of the heart disease. They really do sound super, but are they spicy? Bro, they don't taste like nothing. Oh, yeah. Avocado. I love you. <laughs> so mushy, so flavorless. <laughs> I like it. Crime alert. Shall we go with him? He'll be fine. Playtime is over, Cinderblock. <laughs> From this shield, it looks like avocado skin. <gasps> avocado, super food. Kill punch. Big slam, big slam. Seed smash. Mezzo It seems avocados truly are a superfood. I never thought I'd admit this, Cyborg, but the Teen Titans are way better at silly cartoons. Who would have thought we could translate so seamlessly into broad comedy? It feels good not to be weighed down by character development, yo. I believe this is the definitive incarnation of the Teen Titans. While everyone can agree that this has been a change for the better, we still got a job to do. Swirl! <gasps> <gasps> You want to hit him with a mallet, don't you? Yes! You want to shove a stick of dynamite down his throat, don't you? Oh, yeah! You want to drop an anvil on his head, don't you? Yes! Well, now that we're hilarious cartoons, we can do all that horrible stuff. Stop it, you guys! Ow. So, 
What do you think? Both are very satisfactory to me. I still don't care. We're going to need a taste test to settle this. These culinary titans are no strangers to kitchen combat. Look at that concentration. Unbelievable. I've never seen anything quite like it. Amazing! Can you believe what you're seeing? Gotta cleanse your palate. Oh. Get rid of that nasty burrito test. agree that some people like one food and some people like another one? No! Uh-huh. Thanksgiving? Worst? Blasphemy! Literally every other holiday is better than Thanksgiving. It is true. Upon the Halloween, one Don Johnson's the fun costume. <laughs> Upon the Easter, one searches for the multicolored ovoids. <laughs> and on that Christmas, you ain't be giving no thanks. You be getting them presents. Uh. Thanksgiving is just the same food at the same table with the same people getting into the same arguments about politics. And you should be thankful for that. Those are all time-honored Thanksgiving traditions. So we got to do all that nonsense just because it's traditions? Yes! That's how traditions work! Are not the people you spend the holiday with more important than the traditions? Nope! Now let's celebrate! Thanksgiving tradition number one! Going around the table and saying what you're thankful for. I have a lot to be thankful for, so I'll go first. <clears throat> I am thankful for <clears throat> my tight buns <clears throat> and toned abs. <sighs> Who would like to go next? Um, I've got something to be thankful for, bro. That's wonderful, Beast Boy. Please, go ahead. From the bottoms of my heart, I am thankful for poop. You can't be thankful for poop! But I am! I'm thankful for all the good poop in the world. All that awesome poop in France makes me want to sing and dance. All that poop in Italy makes me feel like wiggly. Russia, Egypt, Bangladesh, all their poop is super fresh. Guatemala, Liechtenstein, I'm about to lose my mind. Uh, sit down. Raven, what is something you are thankful for? And it better not be poop. I'm thankful for having a friend like you, Robin. Why, thank you, Raven. I, I, wait, was that sarcasm? Yes. Starfire, be thankful, and it can't be sarcastic. All about poop. I am thankful that the Christmas is only one month away. Terrible. Moving on. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, cranberry. I cannot participate in the Black Friday this year. <laughs> but Black Friday is the most important holiday of the year. <laughs> I do not care for it. The waiting in line, the elbows, the buying of the unnecessary items. Black Friday is the one holiday everyone can agree on because everyone loves a bargain. Standing in long lines so you can buy things for 70% off is the ultimate act of love. 
Starfire, are you forgetting that it is written? Half off 70 inch flat screens. A picture you'll love at a price she'll love. That is just the advertisement for an inexpensive television. So beautiful. I am sorry, but I must Uncle Scrooge McDuck you all and say the <laughs> Pizza! We want it! The big hockey game starts in 15 minutes. Why won't all these people get out of the way? Hmm. That car looks like it's driving on the wrong side of the road. It's the hive! And they look angry. Get us out of here! Go, go, go! We're gonna have to work together to get out of this one. That sounds like team bonding! You wanna see some magic star? Abracadabra! They're still on us! Engage autopilot! I'm gonna need an assist here, Beastie. Well, uh, I'm not sure if I have the strength to fight them. Booyah! Snacks! Let's do this! Working. What can I do? Just keep reading. Cool. Oh. Out the window! Out the window! Oh yes! Sweet. Yeah. That was cool. Even if we didn't make it to our destination, your road trip was pretty fun. Wait, this is it. This is point B. We made it. It's just more road. I told you, it's not about the destination. It's about the journey. Whatever. The important thing is, it's over. Half over. Now we gotta go from point B back to point A. That's the best part. Road trip! Yeah, we're never doing that again. We live here now. <laughs> You're the best. The worst part is they put the tub back in the freezer even though it's empty. I mean, who does that? Us, apparently. Forget the snacks. We'll just play some video games. Do we need to call a doctor, Robin? He looks like he is in the pain. <laughs> I thought you'd be more excited. We have no idea what you just said. Oh, I'm ordering you a pizza. <laughs> That's right, pizza. Pizza. <laughs> pizza. 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 <laughs> That's more like it. So the toppings. Hawaiian. Hello, Hawaiian. Veggies. Crab necks with mint. Black olives. Yeah. Pepperoni! Quiet! What I was trying to say is I didn't have the money for toppings, so it will be plain cheese. Now, before we dig in, I want everyone's assurance that we will enjoy this pizza responsibly. What are you even talking about, brah? For some reason, every time we eat pizza, we end up fighting over it and running around silly and everything. That does not sound like us. Well, a little. Pizza makes you all do both goofy humor and goofy random humor. I don't want any of that. Understood? 
You are the overacting, Robin. It is only the pizza. Look at what you've become, Titans. Running around silly and everything. You have to stop this. Because I haven't gotten a slice yet! Pizza, 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 pizza! Well, I sincerely hope we all learned a little bit about the importance of favoring your food. We sure did. Thanks, Robin. There's just one more thing. Biggest belly is in charge! Uh, seriously, you guys eat like animals. <laughs> oh, so good. What, Raven? Well, I guess you get a pass, but you two are disgusting. Mm, sorry, it's just Robin makes the best sandwiches. It's true. I've developed a sandwich design that will take your mouth on a flavor journey. A flavor journey worth a journey of its own. Oh, yeah. I'd crawl over a hundred miles of broken glass for this sandwich. I'd drive across the country in a car that smelled like Cyborg's B.O. for this sandwich. Ha <laughs> ha! Ain't no mountain high enough to keep me away from this sandwich. Well, yeah, I'd do some, uh, incredibly difficult stuff for that sandwich, actually. So you're saying you'd leave this tower if I told you where to find a good sandwich? Sure, but it would have to be a legendary sandwich like mine. There is an ancient sandwich of power hidden away from those who would use its power for evil. <laughs> okay, first of all, that's dumb, and you made it up. Second, even if it is true, my sandwiches are the best, period. Oh, but it is true. Behold. Ooh, is it story time? In an age long forgotten, an old king summoned his sandwich wizard. The king commanded him to create a sandwich of power. The sandwich wizard labored in his tower for six days. On the seventh, he brought the sandwich before the king, and it was glorious. It would grant him eternal life, so he could rule his kingdom forever. It was also delicious. <laughs> delicious? One night, the prince betrayed the king and tried to steal the sandwich. The old king was heartbroken. He realized the sandwich was too powerful. It had to be destroyed, so the ingredients were hidden away in the far corners of the world, watched by the fierce sandwich guardians. Legend says it can be reforged if all the ingredients are brought together. We got to get that sandwich. Oh, man, I want to eat it twice. The sandwich will look beautiful in my hair. No way can it top my sandwich science. What are we waiting for? Titans, go! Man, that was some good pizza. Maybe too good. Is it too early for the breakfast pizza? It's too early. And it's too late. What does that even mean? Conquer. Bro, this is out of control! If only we savored our meals, we wouldn't be 
in this situation? It's time to teach those bellies how to eat. Starfire, Raven, you know what to do. Nice try, but how will they savor these delicious treats without their smile bones? <laughs> they took our smile bones, bro. How are we going to savor our food now? Take ours. Oh, man. Do you eat anything other than fish? Quick, Raven, give Beef Boy your smile bones. Ew, no way. You do it, Star. <sighs> Very well. <laughs> What are they doing? They're enjoying their food! Just red. If I catch any of you lambs jocking my style, I will mess you up. Don't hush the Lisa. Yeah. Look, Chip, it's that loser. Yo, what's up, loser? I know you are, but what am I? <gasps> what? Never seen a rad dude with a bad dude before? Yo, you think you're rad, huh? Then why don't you race us down the demons this is tongue? <gasps> the, 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 the demon's tongue? This is so scared! <laughs> In your dreams, you want a race? You got one. Whoa, Robin, you better chickity check yourself before you riggedy wreck yourself. Indeed. I fear you are the tripping and will be left in the poor health. Broskies, the demon's tongue is... <gasps> the most dangerous race in the world. I don't care. I've got to do this. I've got to prove to the old man that rollerblading is important. But what if you are the injured? Tomorrow isn't promised to any of us, Star. And what if I don't take that chance? Do I just wake up every day to go to my job in the mines? What? The point is, I don't want that life! If I'm really rad, I have no choice. Then it's on! Tomorrow, we race! Later, losers! May the raddest dude win! Psych! Oh, he was gonna shake his hand, but he didn't shake his hand! Man, that dude has a real tune! <laughs> I need some pretzel bread, the freshest you've got. Make it quick. This place is really bumming me out. Ah. You're gonna need a drink of water with this hot sauce, baby! Ah! Oh, it's on now. Give me that bacon! Looks. You're pretty angry, huh? Oh! Hey! Be cool, man! Okay, dude. Let's talk about this face to face! I am thinking perhaps this is too much trouble for a tomato! You know, some people prefer swords or, like, lasers, but I like to use this staff. See? Just crack, 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 right on the head, the knee, crack, clavicle, whatever. <laughs> really gets the job done.
Whatever.